What's up, good people? It's 3C in the building. This is the second time because um, my phone keep ringing. Y'all know, if you know about me, you know I record. Excuse me. I record on my phone. <coughs> Excuse me for coughing. <clears throat> I have bronchitis, but it doesn't have me. It's a haul, y'all. And it's raining. Mm hmm Texas. <laughs> we get weather that you don't get. No, I'm just kidding. But we do. So it's thundering and lightning. It's pouring down raining. And <clears throat> it's a mess. But we're moving on. So I don't know if you guys knew, but Furl's had a sale. I, I know, I know. Oh, she's the Furl's representative. She's the Furl's girl. She's going to solicit Furl's, blah, 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 all things Furl's. Eh, yeah, I love Furl's. Do I think Furl's has the best hooks? It's just a good hook to me. I, I think Clover has good hooks. I think Furl's has good hooks. I think... You know, when I first started crocheting, all we had was was the Susan Bates and Boy. It was the two. That's how I started with metal hooks, and I hated them. <laughs> I did, because they hurt my hand, because I'm a knife gripper. And with knife gripping, I was gripping it, because I didn't know how to control my tension with my hand. Not the, not the yarn tension, but my tension. And so... I thought you had to grip the hook. <laughs> and so that's neither here nor there. Um, I love furrows hooks. They're light, especially, okay, let me, let me just say this. I think the resin hooks are very nice. They're smooth, they're easy to handle, and they glide like the best. But that's my opinion, I'm sticking with it. So, for us had a sale, y'all. I'm telling you, if you utilize these uh, YouTubers that are affiliates of these companies like Furrows, Premier, Lion Brand, Yarn Inspirations, or uh, Hershner's. I don't know if Hershner's has these, an affiliate link. Might. Whoever. If, if a YouTuber... If a podcaster, a YouTube uh, uh, creator posts that they have an affiliate link to anything, click on it. It doesn't cost you anything. It gives them a small return on a beautiful investment. And you get in on the good good. So to that end, my girl. The crocheting sailor herself, Ola Jo. Shout out to my girl. What up, girl? She uh, did a little um, short about Harrison having his 29th birthday again. Harrison done turned 29 about 50 million times, child. I don't care how many times he turned 29. Keep on turning 29, Harrison. I'm going to keep getting in on the sale, honey. Thank you very much. 29 year old so anyway he <laughs> turned 29 and all of the hooks on the site were 29 percent off and you know your girl I <laughs> let me just say this you're in for a treat so this is this is again all of these are resin hooks and all of them are absolutely beautiful. This is the Andromeda. It's an eye hook. And I know some of you go go ask the infamous question when I when I get around to it. So that's the Andromeda. I got that in a uh, 5.5 uh, millimeter size. This is another Andromeda. I say like the Andromeda, like I'm Russian. This is in a J. Oh, just exquisite. Just beautiful. 
just ugh. and it it has little flecks of gold dust and it's just gorgeous so that was another andromeda this is from the uh well this is cafe and i i have another cafe i've been wanting i wanted the whole series but they're no longer i don't think they you know what i did was i got as many as i could get because by the time i found out about it half of the sizes were gone so this is a k this is the cafe Ooh. just beautiful beautiful um then I got the Gemini. Now Gemini is a a twin sign. I think it's a twin sign. I got the caster. This is the caster. And I don't know if you can see the gold dust at the bottom and in the middle. Ooh, this thing is beautiful. I'm going to stop turning and just leave it like that. Let's see. And then I'll let you see the bottom part. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So that's the Gemini and Castor. They had the, what was it called? Castor and, it was a Castor and Cream. I don't remember. But the other one is like a white and gold. Woo, it's gorgeous. I wanted both of them, but they don't have the other one anymore. And then this is called Pisces. And I have it, but there are no two hooks the same. There are no two hooks the same. So that's the Pisces. It's like a black, basically. Um, and then the last one I got is called the Supernova. And I have, and, and if you looked at my video a while back where I compared the furrows to the Omi hooks, I have Omi hooks the same color. <laughs> now you're probably wondering, looking at this, this is another J. Why are you buying them J's? You got J's and K's. J's and K's. I have approximately one, two, three. I have three J hooks, three six millimeter hooks, and two 6.5 hooks. And I'll tell you why. Usually, when I'm doing something like blankets, cowls, scarves, regular, regular, uh, you know, basic scarves. I'm going to use a J or K hook. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Because most of your yarns, if it's like a three millimeter or a four, and you add a yarn to it, if you double up the yarn, you already got the hook size that, that's going to carry both yarns through. So that's why I use mostly, my favorite hook size is a J. But now, if I'm doing something where a gauge is involved, I will, true to size, utilize the hook that the yarn is asking for. I may go up a size, but it's never two sizes. It may I may go up just one size. So if, if the yarn is asking for an eye hook, I'll go up to a J. If, this a, if the yarn is asking for H, I'll go up to an I, maybe, or I'll stay at an H. I, I try not to because it's just, it gets tight. It, it, depending on the, the pattern, depending on the uh, stitch, all of that comes into play. Y'all know that. Come on. I'm talking to other creators and other uh, fiber artists. So y'all know how I, come on now. Anyway, those are my hooks from Furrows. Um... I hope that you got in on it. Shout out again to my girl, the crocheting sailor, Ola Joe. Mwah, thank you again. Don't stop putting out that content, girl. 
Okay. Do not. <laughs> Please. I'm begging you. Do not stop putting out the the shorts or the the where you know how you guys post. I'm still learning how to do that. Post a little information. Hit my affiliate link. There's a sale, 50% off or whatever. Or you post it to your community page um, and you let us know it's on the community page, your affiliate link or whatever, what, what's going on. And here's the uh, code to put in when you're checking out. Please don't stop doing that because it helps me. Um, it, it helps me save. I say, listen. Because I used the, the word Harrison, they took $42.62 off my total. <laughs> Thank you, Ola Joe. Now, y'all can play if you want to. I got friends in high places. Thank you, Ola Joe, for that wonderful, wonderful sale. Um, I'm coming with another haul probably tomorrow. Probably tomorrow um, from Lion Brand. I got, uh, it was a good sale that Lion Brand had and I just grabbed, I, I didn't grab all the things because I got to reel it in with the money situation. It's kind of tight right now. So, um, but I did get um, 12 cakes of the, what is it called? Sunset, sunset nights or whatever. I'm going to show it to you tomorrow. Um, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic evening, uh, morning, whenever you see this video, shout out to all my new subbies. Mwah. Give yourself a big hug for me. Thank you so much for, uh, subbing to my channel. I'm trying to hit that thousand mark. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. You see that number? I'm almost there. Um, come back. Like, comment, subscribe. So you won't miss any of my videos. Okay. But this was it. Um, all of my beautiful, beautiful hooks from Furls. I just... <sighs> Furls, honey. Furls. Um, go get you some. Ain't nothing wrong with furls. I, I gotta do this. I gotta learn how to do a thumbnail. Ugh. But this, these hooks, and look how the packaging is. You turn one one side, and then it links up. I furls. I love them. All right, that's it for me. Peace.